Yeehaw! And welcome back to the Southern Snack, where life is too short to be serious. Man, caribou coffee. Y'all are expensive. I bought three small espresso shakers for this review and ran me 18 something. Six dollars a coffee, and they're small, but they're not too small, so I'll give them credit. But uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, so we're going to try them. Espresso shakers. You've got white chocolate, caramel, and vanilla. And uh, I guess what I'll do is, um, I mean, I can't hold three coffees. They all look the same. They all look light brown. So, um, you know, that's how it is. So, I love the, uh, the, the really cool, unique container they've got here. But anyways, I hope you subscribe, like, and comment on this video, and uh, let's get to rolling. All right, so, white chocolate. Oh, and it's made with oat milk. So it's espresso, oat milk, and flavoring. And honestly, so far, I think this is going to be the best review we've had from Caribou. Most of the time, I'm not super impressed, but I've only been twice. This time, I, I like this white chocolate. It's smooth, it's sweet, it's spunky, you know, with that coffee flavor. And of course, you got notes of oat milk. It's a very enjoyable drink. Yeah, I give that a solid eight. I, I really enjoy that. Um... A lot of flavors going in there, but it works to perfection. It's smooth. So, all right, we're moving on to vanilla. It's a similar concept. Not quite as smooth, but you got a robust vanilla um, flavor. I like this one too. Maybe not as much as the white chocolate, um, but it, it, it really is enjoyable. You got a good mix of that oat milk, the espresso, and then there is a bold amount of vanilla. Yeah, it works well. I give that a seven and a half. I think how it could be better is that that vanilla has an even bigger impact. Uh, than it did. So anyways, we're ending it off with caramel. So the more I drink these, the less, less impact each flavor has. So white chocolate had the strongest hold. Vanilla was a little less. But ca caramel is really lacking in my opinion. Like, there are, there, that next line of sips I just took was, a, was an improvement. But I don't know, I, I just don't think this is quite as good. It's decent, and you do get some notes of caramel, but it's not, you know, I, I, I can't get out of my mind, you know, when I go to Starbucks, get this, you know, the caramel ribbon, or if I go to Dunkin' and get the Charlie, it's just not quite as caramel uh, forward as, as those drinks. Not to say anything's wrong with this. But I'm not vibing with it as much. Yeah, I give it a six. Um, I was thinking maybe a seven, but it's just not driving enough caramel in there um, 
to, to, you know, to give it that emphasis I need. So a six for that one. This review really went downhill, but I definitely recommend white chocolate and vanilla. Caramel, you might want to tell them put an extra pump of caramel. Um, other than that, that's the newest drinks at uh, Caribou Coffee. New oat milk espresso shakers available for, I guess, a limited time. Other than that, they do have a strawberry cake pop, and I'm disappointed I didn't get to review it. Um, they didn't have it. But anyways, that's my review. I'm sticking to it, and I will see y'all around. Yee!